Sheldon speaking. Today I'm traveling to Goa by Konkan Kanya Express and the train number is 10111. I'm in coach HA1 which is a first class AC as well as a two tier AC um, combination of both the classes. I'm a bit disappointed because I didn't get the coupe but I'm in the cabin right now. So there's four seats. Uh, to be more precise it's four berths. Two on one side, two on the other. This is my mother. She's traveling with me. She's always been my travel companion and a wonderful one. She's smiling. She's happy to see you all. The bedding is already ready, done by my mother. This is the Indian Railway bedding. And this is my mother's boat. We have three bags. One, two, and three. This is my camera bag. I don't count that as a baggage. These are the stairs through which I will climb and go to my boat. That's about it. Plain and simple. I hope I get some good co-passengers, not someone who's noisy and goes yam 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 and doesn't give us to sleep. That's all I need. I will document my journey and I'll let you know. I plan to get off at each and every station after Panvel, but I'm not too sure how far I can do it. But let's go and see how it is. I'm glad you are joining me today. Good morning everyone. We've just passed Villa Bay Station. I came to film because we had some daylight. It's early morning around 6.30. The train is one hour and 10 minutes late. But then I didn't use a proper setting on my camera and I realized that I really didn't get the footage. I did wake up when the train reached Panvel, Chiplun and Ratnagiri. I did get off the train at Ratnagiri but couldn't really feel much because it was quite dark. So hopefully all the other stations from now on I'm going to film them and see how it goes. There's a lot of fog though and it's quite cold. We are in a tunnel right now. We have reached Rajapur station. We yeah. are an hour and 20 minutes late at this stage. This is the coach and this is cabin A, the one in which we are travelling. The train has already left. I'll just enter the train. I got Shira and Opma for breakfast. Let's see how it tastes like. It's quite hot though. Looks very nice. And we've just reached Vaibhavadi Road, again one hour and 20 minutes late. Just past Kankamli station like you saw it and this is the weather, quite foggy. Which a nice bridge. You can see a few morning birds and nice formation of rocks as well. Let's see if we'll reach on time at Matkao. Sintadurg station and some construction going on over here, probably for some new track laying. And this is a level crossing. Soon there'll be a thing of the past. Happy to see construction in full swing. It's around 8.30 right now and we are still late. Hopefully the train covers up the distance. You see that building in the background? I've been looking at that building for years together. Just a sort of nostalgic feeling for me. So 
सात वाली रोड ब्रिज सात वाली रोड विच इज द लास्ट स्टॉप इन महाराष्ट्र द नेक्स्ट स्टॉप विल बी पहने एंड दैट विल बी द फर्स्ट स्टॉप इन गोवा वी आर ऑलरेडी वन वन आवर इन ट्वेंटी फाइव मिनट्स लेट फॉर गॉट टू शो यू दिस इज द एंट्रेंस ऑफ द एच ए वन पॉच जस्ट अबाउट नाइन ट्वेंटी फाइव एम एंड वी हैव रीच्ड पेरने विच इज द फर्स्ट स्टॉप इन गोवा द ट्रेन इज वन आवर एंड ट्वेंटी मिनट्स लेट बट वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग इट टू रीच मार्क आउ एट टेन फोर्टी फाइव और मे बी टेन फिफ्टी फाइव जस्ट बे फॉर लेवन which is the usual time for the train to reach cross tini station right now we are still an hour and 20 minutes late but by the time we reach macau we should be almost on time that's because the railways allow a longer time schedule between karmali which is the next station and margao so i'm happy that we will be reaching on time after that i have also asked for self drive car which will come to margao station and then i will drive to the resort where i'll be living and that is seagull resort in betu i'll let you know how it goes
And we are reaching Verna right now. You can see far off in the background. Over there. There's grain being loaded and all of the trucks and they are standing in the queue. Tanks in the north. We used to use it to refuel the diesel locomotives. Not too sure whether they still use it right now, as most of Pokhara Railway has been electrified and almost all of the passenger and express trains using electric tracks. There seems to be a DENU. That's a DENU which is used for local services in and around. Goa and Karnataka. And this is the for the boat. Another old coach with a green color. And these are some electric locomotives, something that we already used to see before. So here I am at Seagull Resort. I reached Margao Station at 10.55. The train was just 10 minutes late towards the end. However, I waited at the station till 11.45 because I was waiting for the self-drive car. There was a delay. But the car came over here, got fresh, and now we'll be going to meet few relatives. So if you like this video, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel so that every single time I post new adventures like these, you'll get notified. Take care of yourself, stay safe, and see you in the next one.